Looking for the best 3D printer but not sure which one actually delivers? Stick around as we break down the top contenders from budget-friendly to pro-level beasts. Let's kick things off with the FlashForge Adventurer 5M, coming in at the base of our ranking. It's a solid machine, no doubt, and a great option if you're just starting out. It checks the basics with decent speed and precision thanks to the core XY structure, and it runs pretty quietly too, making it home-friendly. The Adventurer 5M prints fast and gives you good detail with a range of nozzle sizes to suit different jobs. It also offers a fully enclosed design, which helps print stability, and features like vibration compensation and easy nozzle swapping are nice bonuses for the price point. But it does have some limitations. There's no support for multicolor or multi-material printing, and that can be a deal breaker if you're looking to get more creative. The software also has a few quirks, and while it's not a huge issue, it does trail behind competitors in connectivity and ecosystem polish. If you're someone who's just getting into 3D printing and wants something reliable without the bells and whistles, the Adventurer 5M is worth considering. And by the way, you'll find links to every printer in this video at the best prices right down in the description. Next up, we've got the Bamboo Lab A1 Mini Combo. Don't let the Mini fool you, this little machine packs a surprising punch for its size. It's compact, lightweight, and quiet, making it perfect for home setups or small workspaces. What's cool about the A1 Mini is that it's fully pre-assembled and ready to go out of the box. It also supports up to four colors using the AMS light system, and features a bunch of smart calibration tools, like automatic bad leveling, flow adjustment, and vibration tuning. It's super beginner-friendly and doesn't compromise on precision. That said, the small build volume means you're limited to smaller models, and it doesn't handle high temperature filaments like ABS or PC very well. The AMS light system also adds some bulk to an otherwise compact setup. If you're after a plug-and-play printer that's quiet, smart, and easy to manage, the A1 Mini might just be your new favorite tool. And hey, if you're enjoying this so far, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more hands-on reviews like this one. Sliding into the mid-range spot is the Frozen Sonic Mega 8KS, a resin printer built for massive, high-detail projects. If you're into miniatures, denture models, or anything that demands insane surface quality, this one is definitely for you. It comes with a huge 8K monochrome screen and a generous print volume, so you can produce detailed parts in batches. The pre-calibrated plate makes setup a breeze, and the built-in drip hanger helps keep things neat when you're handling resin. However, it's not perfect. There's no Wi-Fi or onboard storage, which feels a little dated. And it doesn't include built-in heating or air filtration, which can be important when printing with resin in less ventilated spaces. Still, if detail is your top priority and you're ready to deal with the usual resin printer workflow, the Mega 8KS is a powerful tool to have in your arsenal. Climbing higher on the list, we have the Anycubic Cobra S1 Combo. This one strikes a great balance between speed, versatility, and value. It delivers fast, stable prints with good accuracy, and supports multicolor printing with the optional Ace Pro module. The Cobra S1 has a fully enclosed core XY frame and a dual gear direct drive extruder, which gives it great consistency even with flexible filaments. It's also pretty quiet and comes with helpful AI features like spaghetti detection and power loss recovery, but it's not perfect. TPU is only supported in single color mode, and you'll need to buy the extra module for full multicolor capabilities. It also takes up a decent amount of desk space for a mid-sized printer. If you're looking for a flexible printer that can grow with your skills, the Cobra S1 Combo is a fantastic pick. And now, the top dog in today's roundup, the Creality K2 Plus Combo. This thing is a powerhouse. It's designed for serious creators who want it all. Speed, precision, massive build volume, and advanced features baked in. With room for big projects and support for up to 16 colors when paired with the CFS units, the K2 Plus makes multicolor printing seamless. It's packed with AI tools like spaghetti detection and flow tuning, and its sturdy die-cast aluminum frame keeps everything solid even at top speeds. Sure, it has a few downsides. The preheat time is longer than most, and you'll deal with more filament waste during color changes. It also demands a lot of space and comes with a steeper price tag. But if you want the best all-around 3D printer that can handle anything you throw at it, the K2 Plus combo is absolutely the one to be. All the top picks from this review are linked in the description below, so make sure to check them out. And if this video helped you out, don't forget to like and subscribe. More in-depth gear breakdowns are on the way.